In this video, you're gonna learn how to do trap hi-hats or any type of hi-hats easy. A beginner's guide for anybody. It could be for you intermediate guys or whatever because I know a lot of people struggle with that in Ableton Live. Trap Tendo. So I'm gonna go ahead and play this track real quick. It features a live play guitar by me and it sounds like this. And now we're gonna start from the beginning. So the first thing I'm gonna do, which is the captain obvious thing, is to select a hi-hat. So what I'm gonna do here is just show you the simple step. And you're gonna find a hi-hat. So that is the hi-hat that I want. Boom. Uh, the next thing, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this clip. Don't worry about that. It's just me getting rid of the clip. Uh, you're gonna right click on a clip right here and insert clip. So we don't have anything playing right now because we have to draw on the hi-hat. So the next thing you're gonna do here is press B. You're gonna press B because that's where you want to be. So pressing B will bring up this draw tool. So let's go ahead and draw out some hi-hats here. It's only a one bar loop so far. And we got to press play on the clip. And you'll notice something, that the hi-hats are a wee bit too fast for the taste or the flavor of this track. Depends on the person. Now we're gonna learn a shortcut, which is Control-1, which will speed up the hi-hats that you'll draw out. So if I was to draw in there now. And that's not what we want. So if Control-1 is to adjust it upwards or make it faster, then Control-2 will be to make it go slower. And if you pay attention to the bottom right of the screen, you can see your time signature. So 1 16th was too fast, so I need 1 8th. So I'm gonna go ahead and redraw that. And what do we get? As you can see, it's really simple. Okay, so that seems more of a vibe, but we all know that Everybody that makes trap hi-hats these days has some type of really fast time signature somewhere. So now we're going to press control one and it's going to bring up one sixteenths again. And what I'm going to do is draw in two hi-hats right here. Now it's still not the flavor of everybody now. So what we're going to do is draw in some faster hi-hats and go up in here the same way. So we can get rid of that and we can draw in some more hi-hats. So, so if you want those pitchy 2016 style hi-hats in 2019, you can still do it in Ableton just like any other DAW. Uh, now, the real trick question, what does Control 3 do? Now Control 3, gives you triplets. So if you really want those fast triplets in your hi-hats, now you have 132 triplets. And you can slow them down to 1 16th, and we're gonna just draw that in there. It might not sound very good, but let's find out what it sounds like. We can slow it down by one and two. Uh, one going upwards, two going downwards. So let's go ahead and put it at one eight triplets at the end. So we have that. Now, for those who don't have a push or, or something like that, you can use these bars over here to make this clip longer. Uh, now that you make the clip longer, you can go up to like maybe three right here and you can draw more hi-hats. So now we're gonna go down here, which is how you navigate the piano roll. And now you can see all your hi-hats again. Now, say you actually like what you had at the beginning here, you're gonna press B so you can bring up the selection tool. And then you're gonna highlight everything by pressing control or command and then drag, left click drag, or just drag and boom. Now from here that you have everything's highlighted, you can go ahead and press control, hold control and then just drag everything over. Boom, then you have it. 
Now, perhaps you may want to do some other stuff to it and you don't like the last part. Of course, it's just control and highlight everything that you want. And then you select delete or press delete. And, you know, you can do whatever you want from there, from those shortcuts that I gave you. So, you know, if you don't want triplets anymore, you just press three, boom. And that takes away the triplets. Now I'm going to go over here and just maybe put like one sixteenths at the end and then press B to bring up that tool. And we're going to go ahead and draw some stuff out randomly. And I'm going to just go down a little lower. And I'll just press one again to get 64, 164 and draw those in. Now that we have that, let's hear it. And as simple as that, you have trap high hats, really easy, simple, and all you had to do was that. Now, we're gonna go over here into the arrangement view because you may not work into the, the clip view there. So from the arrangement view, uh, you can do hi hats as well. And we're gonna make sure that we're on the hi hat channel. We're gonna go right here, and then we're gonna select these bars. Of course, this is four bars or two bars in double time, but we're just not gonna go into that conversation again. And select all that, and then do this right click, insert MIDI clip, and insert MIDI clip, and then just draw everything out if you lay your beats out that way. And hey, there goes your hi-hats right there, simple and sweet. Leave a comment below.